This for the true wireless things that are broken. Uh, the Fio true wireless. Are you trying to shop for true wireless things that are broken? No, no, I'm not trying to shop for that. Stop, cease. My favorite word is cease. I'm gonna get a really mean like attack dog and I wanna make sure he knows the word cease. Pasta, if you wanna start working on Audrey, where cease means stop. Cease your current event, your current action, whatever it is, killing the mailman. These were in my mailbox, I don't know how long. Ooh, the updated Pentagon 666 balance 4.4 Deconi wire. Deconi cables with a Z. I don't know why they put a Z on it. All right, maybe it's my fault, maybe it's not my fault. But um, I've had the previous one of this. And um, as far as like, like you can get periapt cables, you can get hard audio cables, you can get uh, Liar the Cable Guy. But uh, this is very simple, and I'm hoping that they sell it for a very cheap price. Because it just says Deconi Audio 4.4 Pentacon. It is a weave, it's a little eight weave. Uh, currently, I don't think they have any other colors but the black. And the guy at Deconi was like, he's tired of buying other people's cables. They have to do all this testing, so he's like, oh, it's a mix of cables. So very, very plain, is that aluminum? Yeah, it's aluminum on aluminum, so that's just, there's nothing. I like when there's nothingness. It's got the little clear bead you could slide up and down. Um, there's a knot in it there. It's just, it's just nice. And I actually, I've never seen this type of a Sennheiser connector before. Uh, it's weird, it's like aluminum. This sticks out a little bit far from how I like. Like I'd prefer if it was, if it ended there, it'd be great, but I don't think they can make it or however the hell they made these or wherever they bought them from. But look at this. This is this is this is an ideal. If you were somehow taking a 4.4 Pentacon Sennheiser headset out, it's it's just, it's just a nice it's a nice little IM cable. It's literally an IM cable for headphones, which uh, we've talked about that previously or in the future. Should I was gonna do I'm gonna do a stream today. It's almost four o'clock. I don't know. I streamed. I was very drunk. Who did this box? Someone just cut the edges of this box to make this box a box. I've been staring at my computer, not doing anything for a bit. I'm watching a guy buy a Sherp. I'm like, do I need a Sherp? If you don't know what a Sherp is, Pasta doesn't know what a Sherp is. She will though. She will one day. We have got a paper towel roll wrapped in bubble wrap. And it says Kenrad 6SG7. So this is the most interesting way I've ever seen anyone ship tubes. These are more tubes, courtesy of Joe, for Joe's thing. I'm going to be, I'm going to like unpeel this like he would biscuits because I feel like that's, I'm not going to be transporting these in a paper towel. Hope he didn't blow his nose in this. Made in the USA, Kenrad. Okay, so we've got some tubes. This is weird. This is weird. It's not a stupid idea, it's brilliant, but it's, this is temporary. I wouldn't store them in that. Everyone's running out right now to buy, just rolling paper towels off their rolls. Yeah, so here's some nice vintage Kenrads, which will go over here, because we're gonna have to test out all tubes. I got all tubes now, buddy. I've got these, I've got these Millards, I've got these tongue soles. I've got whatever the fuck. Maybe there's, is there anything, there's nothing in here? Yeah, it's just a box. I'll probably end up packing all these. There's a way to, you need like a specific tool, tube holding case. So these don't have an actual holder. So I'm gonna put them on that. And this bad boy gets its review soon. <sighs> Chewbacca's been hanging around it too long. All right, moving on. My stomach tells me this is my AirPod Max. I'm sorry, AirPods Max, which I don't like. That's dumb, I hate it. Oh yeah, look at the, the innovative, fully opening thing. So this apparently left China three days ago, and then it said Taiwan, and then it wasn't in Taiwan anymore. It was literally erased from the from the. Um, that was a cool box, by the way. My granddaddy was a die cutter. Um, it was erased from the tracking history, and then it was like, yeah, Kentucky, and now here. So I got them a little bit late. I've actually borrowed a friend of uh, my friend's AirPod Max, and did the review and now I'm gonna sell it for him. 
But this is my pair. It's the pair I ordered. This has my custom engraving. It's in the color I wanted. And um, here's its unboxing. So, box, smooth, embossed. I could feel the raised picture. Oh, it's, it doesn't even need to say Apple anywhere because everyone fucking knows what it is. I got the blue one, by the way, which is why it took an extra like two whole weeks or two and a half weeks. It was supposed to not come till January. That's weird. What they do? A, it's it's down and then it's up. It's down and then it's up. Um, I'll give you I'll give you a re-review of the review since this is the unboxing channel pasta. Um, when you by the time you release this, the full on full fuck review will be out. You can link that in the description. Uh, here, hold on. We have got a lame ass wire. And I say lame ass wire. I like to do this like wrap thing and that's cool and it's very, very straight. And I think the wire is nice and straight and that's, that's great, little, this little thing. Come on. My problem with this is it's USB-C and you know, I don't know about you, but I only have USB chargers. So now I have a lightning to USB-C and I gotta plug it into my like laptop side thing. Does this not come with the extra wire? Oh, because DMS ordered the extra wire. So that's it for this. Um, I have this thing, however. Look at this thing. I will link to uh, pasta. This is on MassDrop or it's on ddhifis.com. This is the TC26i and it's a USB-C to lightning thing. So instead of using this cable, I could use this little adapter. We'll get back to that. This has got books. No one reads. This is wrapped in paper along with being leather. So let's take it out of its bra. The, the bra's coming off. It's got, uh, actually these are really nice. I do approve of that, Apple. It's got like cup protectors so they don't get crushed down. But you could see how deep that is. You could see how deep those go. I'd keep these, honestly. And uh, the pads just come right off. And my, one of my problems with these things is that these can go on the wrong direction, like just as easily as they can go on the right direction. And there's a window that looks through, to see the back of your head to say, hey, you're a human, you're wearing me. So um, yeah, no, they needed to put more holes. I love the design, it's elegant, it doesn't, it's small, it's like the size of my hand, yet a full size headphone. I like how this pulls out and then this is spring loaded, all that spring loaded thing can mess with some people. I was gonna say fuck and then I didn't say fuck, I don't know why. Um, LNR, the pad material, it's not for everybody. And I think the biggest flaw is going to be this headband. I love this headband. I fucking love the way it feels right now. But this is a very thin piece of mesh or flexible mesh, you can see it. And it's gonna wear, just like everything wears. Life wears on us all. And when you wear this for three months, it is just wear, 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 where all of a sudden these metal bars are all that's going to be touching your head. I also love the control scheme. Um, it's a it's a knob and a push button and then another push button and that's it. That's it. There's no touch surfaces. Nothing. Nothing. I know for a fact that it's the best active noise canceling of any um, device. Hello. Hello. Hold on. Hello. I can hear myself. Now I'm going to turn on noise canceling, and it's actually like eerily quiet. The biggest issue you're gonna have with these is turning them off because you can't. If you just have these and say, turn them off, you cannot turn them off. They'll be, see the green light? It'll go into standby, but it's not really in standby because it's still Bluetooth connected to whatever device it's connected to. The only way to turn them off is to actually put them back into the little bralet with all the magnets and the magnets indicate to turn it off. So if you go watch my review. You don't need to see all this stuff. I can say it already. Um, as far as an unboxing experience, this is a very light amount of garbage. I like when there's less garbage. Interesting, like wax paper. They like built up a, th a thick wax paper for that. Don't know why. Then this, then those, and then this is just books. Designed by Apple in California. Yeah, it still comes over on a boat from China. I wish, I, I would have infinite respect for Apple. If they just made all their products, in America from as much American source material as possible. And then these would be like $1,200, $1,300, probably $1,500, $2,000. I'd still respect them more and I'd recommend it more. We've given so much, Apple has given so much to China, so much. 
So now I'm gonna go do the sound demo and I'm probably gonna do the sound demo of this pair because guess what? Um, the pair that I had that I fully charged up, I took it out of the case to take pictures of it for the thumbnail I did today and it sat there on all day and killed itself. So now it's dead. So now this is the only pair that has any power in it. So I'm gonna go plug in the adapter that uh, turns into a three and a half millimeter and I'm gonna go do the sound demo. So that's this unboxing, a dedicated only goddamn Apple AirPods, like he they're heavy, this thing with this, and it's so heavy. This is definitely gonna, it's just gonna fail. Like, it's almost failing already. It's almost, just put it on the back of your hand. And like, we've got like an eighth of an inch or four millimeters for you Europeans before it's just not fabric anymore and just metal rods. I don't know how the hell they, like, it's not a bad concept. You just need to be able to replace this or reinforce it better. Oh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this to my pair. Just loosen up that clamp a little bit so that these fit. Because I know that I have to do that for mine. Yeah, it's much better. Much better. Okay. Done. 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 I like the color of this bag more. Moving on. Yeah, guess what? I don't see the word Zeos Pantera engraved on anything here. Son of a bitch. I totally forgot to look. Like, it's just, it's, wait, no, no. Huh. They suck. You suck, Apple. Why do you suck so bad? Steve Jobs was a dick, but at least he got shit done. Oh, there it is. There it is. That's terrible. That's it? That little Zeos Pantera dot, 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 five dots. That's what I get. So they didn't suck that bad. Whatever. Whatever.